foreshadowed by another intimidating defender. The legendary Will Chamberlain also made the paint his home and took great pleasure in rejecting all who tried to trespass. I was blessed with a great vertical leap, and I enjoy uh, going up as a shot blocker, and not only just blocking the shots, but the air. Blocked by Chamberlain, a great block by Chamberlain. So, shot blocking uh, was a thing that uh, was thing about the game of basketball, because you're going to destroy a guy's shot. Also following in Wilt's prodigious footsteps was the stalwart Nate Thurman. Nate Thurman is an incredible defensive basketball player. He was strong with his incredible long arms, because the top of his reach was like that much more than, than mine. I really was offended when anybody got a shot off around me, because you have to play uh, defense tough. You have to let people know that this is my territory, and I want to stop everything that I could. It is a philosophy that has been embraced by all of the league's great big men. What a block by Bob Lanier. But for all the tenacious guardians of the paint that the game has seen, one in particular has become the standard of defensive greatness. Bill Russell made shot blocking an art. Russell not only would block the shots, but 90% of the time when he blocked the shot, we would get the ball. When I blocked the shot, I was just getting it on my fingertips most of the time. And so I didn't swat it, I just hit it, just changed direction. And so the ball stayed in play because my theory on blocking shots was that a defensive play is not over until your team has the ball. With his unique defensive prowess, Russell dictated the flow of the game from under the basket. He had such great quickness and agility that he could play three or four guys on the same trip up the court, switch off, go back to his own man, block the shot. So he would disrupt their, their whole entire offense. West all alone, look at Russell come down. And what a play by Russell! So he revolutionized the game. Then after a while, he became so intimidating, so quick was his reaction that it was like blocking another 10 shots a game, even if he never touched the guy. I can remember playing against him in the fourth quarter, and uh, I went in for four layups in the fourth quarter. He blocked the first two, and I missed the next two looking for him. The guy comes in, and you block the shot. And then you, you might look at him and smile and say, yes, yes, we, we, we did that to you. If you come back, we'll do it again. If you come back again, we'll still we'll do it another time. So you have to find something else to do. That won't work. 